Hi, welcome to Infineon. I'm Phoebe and I'm your tour guide for the day. Come on in. This is our campus and where our new colleagues will join us as part of the Infineon family. The whole floor is dedicated to workshops, trainings, all hands meetings and events. With the extensive development opportunities available to our employees, Infineon is a great place to kickstart your career as a budding engineer. And who knows, you might even get to visit one of our overseas locations, like our headquarters in Munich, Germany. If you aspire to be in R&D, you will work with some of the best minds and state-of-the-art tools here. Today, we are giving you an exclusive access to the Development Center the heart of our R&D activities here at Infineon. Let's go! This is one of our meeting rooms at the Development Center and one of my favorites, the Future at Work Room. This is where innovative and revolutionary ideas are being born, where our engineers are busy shaping and inspiring the future. Every day, we're looking for ways to make life easier, safer and greener. Our R&D activities focus on mobility, energy efficiency, and security, from developing microcontrollers for safe autonomous driving, power supply controllers that deliver high usage efficiency, and authentication controllers to ensure the products you buy are genuine. A typical project in a development center begins after the business case and the system concept have been decided. The project kicks off with a design and layout. This stage covers design entry, functional simulation, design optimization, to physical implementation. Designing a chip is comparable to city planning. Engineers are working on 3D designs that contain multiple layers of connections. We utilize AI to accelerate and optimize this design process and predict routing and floor planning congestions. But there are also other constraints that our engineers need to tackle, such as short channel effects, and gate leakages. Keeping up with the latest design concepts and trends is also a crucial part of the job. But for our design engineer, Philip Lim, the challenges are worth it when he gets to see his design creations come alive, knowing his efforts have contributed to everyday products that improve the quality of life. After the chip design is finalized, what follows is the system on chip verification. Before the chip design can be taped out, all the hardware components need to be checked to ensure full functionality and optimal performance and meet compliance standards for functional safety and cybersecurity. This verification process is done with an array of powerful electronic design automation tools from Cadence and Synosis Suites. Big data and machine learning also play an important part in increasing the speed of testing. It's exciting for Duan Tuan An, design engineer, to be at the forefront of his field, working with the latest technology and methods that many companies have yet to adopt and apply. Some of these include emulator and PSS, portable test and similar standard. Sometime after the chip design is taped up to a semiconductor foundry, the foundry sends us an engineering sample in the form of a wafer. Now it's time to find out if the product works according to a design. Testing takes place in our R&D test labs. Our engineers develop complex test programs and test cases for chip debugging. What you see here is our automatic testing platform, created specifically for TV, PC, adapter, and charger projects. The chip undergoes a temperature stress test inside this chamber. Validating chip robustness is essential to ensure that any defects are identified and to prevent unwanted surprise manufacturing costs. For Thien Johan, application engineer, the process of finding new methods to increase test coverage is one of his favorite parts of the job. Not only does it increase manual work, it also speeds up the project time, bringing us one step closer to production. We have one more place to show you, but this place requires something special. Okay, we're now all ready to go into the clean room. Let's go! Here, we have a whole range of highly advanced and leading-edge machines that can test multiple products for electrical, mechanical, and thermal characteristics in parallel. Take this V93K tester, for example. The tester runs numerous rounds of testing to reject defect, reliability drift, and out-of-specification products. As part of the testing process, 
our test engineers are also developing C++ test methods and customized tools with Python, Java, c -sharp scripts, and Tableau to analyze test data. Once the chip shows peak performance and yield, the product can finally be released for full production. Reaching the stage is a huge accomplishment and motivates our engineers through each step in the development process. Of course, it doesn't just stop at development and production. We need to connect our products to customers, and this is where the system application engineering team comes in. The team takes their understanding of market needs, customer requirements, and system cost performance to present the right products with the right features for specific customer application. In this case, it is a battery management system for electric vehicles. Our microcontrollers not only ensure safe battery charging, but also optimize the lifespan and performance of car batteries. By prolonging the battery life, we can conserve the Earth's precious resources and reduce the burden on the environment. Together with our customers, we create efficient car batteries electric vehicles that contribute to a greener environment. You've seen our labs in our workspace, but our engineers can even apply their ideas in a real environment in our very own office. It's a playground for experimentation and part of the strong innovation culture we have here. This is our cafeteria where we have a smart radar sensor system installed at our entrances. Our cafeteria along with our other office spaces provide a living development environment for us to test and enhance the performance of our works in progress. As we walk in, you'll notice this display with a go and stop sign. This is all connected to a radar right above the entranceway that detects and counts people as they enter and leave the cafeteria via the two entrances. The information is sent to a dashboard that can be viewed on a device such as your phone. Our R&D team built this system to automate crowd management and keep places like restaurants, stores, theaters, and meeting rooms safe. And we've come to the last part of our tour. This is our code innovation space and the first of its kind for Infineon worldwide. We partner with startups to offer our expertise in semiconductors and co-create products. We also provide startups with training and guidance in design thinking, business innovation, and connections within and outside Infineon. The interactions with startups also give our engineers opportunities to build up their system knowledge and experience. So you've seen what we do here at Infineon to make life easier, safer, and greener. We're always looking for like-minded individuals who share our aspirations to join us. So thank you, and we hope to see you soon.